Hey everybody, Nate from Nash the Marks here. We have a crazy egg cutting for you today. This is clutch number five of the 2022 breeding season. The pairing is a pinstripe blade clown female to a sunset male, and we have eight awesome eggs, and they have already started pipping. They haven't all come out yet, but some of them have started pipping, as you can see there. Pretty cool to see how they come through in different spots all over the egg. I'm going to start with this one right here and move this out of the way. We're looking for some blade pinstripe double heads. It's one in four to hit the double coat on. Let's see what we get on the first egg. Super awesome. That is definitely pinstripe. That looks also blade. You can see how much brighter it is than a normal pinstripe. Seem more wacky as well, but also reduced on the sides. I'm not 100% sure. That may just be a crazy looking pinstripe because of the head influence. Two heads in there. Sunset, I have noticed, does make it brighter in the clowns. So it is super cool. Right now, I'd say that is just a pinstripe. We'll have to look at the other babies to see how much the head does impact. Next egg, this one is also pipped, hasn't come out yet though either. Super cool, got some cocoa on there. There we go, another baby. That looks super big in the egg. Looks like he was really ready to come out. You can see how the eye stripes don't come up and meet the head. And it seems a little bit more reduced. I think that might be a blade. So you can see how it's striped down the neck. I can't see the whole baby. But the eye stripes don't meet. They don't always do that, but looks awesome. I say that just the blade could be uh, whacked out normal, like I said earlier, but that is awesome, baby. On to the next one. This one has a little slit there. It doesn't look like he's going to fit, a head, fit his head through, but let's see what this baby is. There we go. He's got a little bit of gel there. That one is brighter. I'm gonna open it up a little bit more. That one looks a little bit more wacky. I would say that is just a normal, but with the head influence, how it makes it makes it brighter. There's his head coming up there a little bit. That one seems a little bit more wacky on the top and the back than the other one. Which would make me lean towards Blade on the second, maybe. On to the fourth. This one, I think, had his head out earlier. Cut out there, as you can see. A little bit of cocoa on the side, too. Opened up right where the area was. He is ready to come out. There, that looks like... Potentially another normal. Hard to tell. I think that's a normal. He pulled his head all the way back in. But you can see his tail. That might be a blade because it's reduced there on the spine and coming down the sides. Pretty hard to tell. Look how less bright it is. This one is way brighter than this one. So is that one too. That one's not quite bright as much brighter, but. On to number five, this one also pipped. You can see there. I also tried there too. It's pretty cool. Right on the X again, where the embryo was. Oh, I can already see this one is definitely a pinstripe. Oh, yeah, look at that. That's super crazy. That one is very whacked out. See there on the sides. 
might be just a regular pinstripe. It's hard to tell. Look how much brighter that one is than this one. This one almost looks faded a little bit. This makes me lean towards Blade on there. They're both really wacky, which is kind of interesting. On to what I believe is the last egg that is pipped. This one here has probably got a little bit of gel coming out. He is pushing away, really ready to come out. Oh yeah. Here's another awesome looking baby. You already tongue looking and everything. That looks like another normal just based on like the swirl there on the spine and the sides. The blade usually reduces it a little bit. I'm not too too sure. You can see his head there a little bit. That one looks like a wacky normal, I would say. Super cool how you can see the contrast from different colors just from snakes that are so similar. Here we go, onto the big scissors. This one has not pipped yet. Feel him pushing away right here and right here. He is definitely ready to come out. There is another pinstripe. Super cool there. That one you can see it coming down and whack out there. That one looks to be a regular pinstripe. You can see the alien heads on the typical pinstripe there and the thin lines on the sides and the spine. It's pretty bright too, which is awesome. Can't see his head yet. Seems buried a little bit down at the bottom of the egg. On to the last one. You can see how flat he is because he's pushing away on the sides. Let's see if I can roll, get him to come out. Oh yeah, he's pushing away even more now. There he is, head right there. Super cool. That one looks maybe like a blade. You can see how the line doesn't come all the way down. His head's coming right out, it's like swirled around it. That one looks almost like a blade if you can see the pattern right there. Kind of not making it all the way. That one bands down more, way more than this one right here how it's swirled in the alien head there. You can see them all. So from seeing the babies, I think this one and this one are both regular pinstripes and this one might be the pinstripe blade double hat. Super cool. These ones are both a little bit brighter. Maybe blades or maybe just really bright hats. Super cool, I cannot wait for the update. I really want to see what these guys turn out and what their genders are. Thank you guys all for coming out. Don't forget to like and share and then hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for coming out.